Good day, people. How are we doing? This is Sandeep from solutionsbuffs.co.in, and uh, this is my another tutorials on CSS website. In the last tutorial, we have created header with text, uh, and I told you we will put some images on the header. So let's start. Okay. So I want to create my header image. Okay. Uh, I have just uh, you can see in the last tutorial we mentioned with 400 and height. 150 pixel uh, I want to change this width because it's too big I want to put uh, height uh, sorry I want to change the height uh, 120 pixel and uh, wrapper height 120 pixel and header wrapper heights 120 pixel and header height 120 pixel okay so not looking nice okay so let's create uh, image for uh, our header okay so this is the photoshop okay so to create 400 height would be 120 pixel okay it okay okay i want to use gradient color okay so this is my color go to here i want to use my own color i love this color okay, okay. Or uh, you can do one more thing. You can go to your website. Okay, here you can see the same color is there. Okay, you can copy. You can copy this color. Go to Photoshop. Go to here and put your own colors. Okay. Uh, once again, okay copy this without hash because hash is already there okay paste and you will get the same color okay so we have both the colors go to gradient and drag from left to right okay and here i'm going to new layer okay and i'm going to put some text okay so my header text would be uh, color would be white go to change the color I'm simply mentioning my website name www.solutionsbox.co.in. Okay. Okay. Click okay. okay. I want to give some modification for this text. Okay. So this is our text. Okay, I want to give some kind of style. Yes. I have to do it so very hard. Fine, okay. Stroke, look not looking good. No, okay, that's it okay so this is our first text and in that we will put learn online and free this is my another text for the header i will change the i will change the language or you can see the font family i will put uh, this one I will change the font size. It okay. Select both the layers. Okay. This is my header text. I'm going to save. Let me do some stuff for this also. Um, Okay, so we have created our header. Let me save this first. Go to file, save for web and device. Okay, I want to save in PNG. Okay, I will save. I will save inside the my folder. Okay, once you save uh, from Photoshop, it will create automatic a folder in the name of 
my this okay let's say okay we have created a logo go to my website folder you can see the english folder there and we have a logo okay so that's good okay now i want to put my logo on my website okay so we have created this okay i will remove my header from here okay i will delete in the header okay in the header this is the header i will put i will delete all this thing okay now i don't want to put any text effect okay i want to put my uh, header okay image so background background color i will not choose color i will choose url okay because we are going to uh, download form folder this okay. so now go to html okay and you can see the images is there okay but please make sure you should mention here after putting the url no repeat if you don't uh, put this thing it will start like uh, it will start from left to right uh, and again and again uh, you can see, you will see the same image okay so please put this thing okay if you don't want to repeat your images okay. so hit save and save all okay save all and go to our website page refresh and you can see the image is there okay now i want to align it's not looking nice in the center i want to align in, in left okay so go to here and delete this one okay now you can see align and if i do move this let's check what would happen okay but please make sure you should mention no repeat otherwise it will repeat and what look good okay it's a wall go to my website yeah here we can see we have created a nice header okay so that's how we can create okay your uh, header okay so we have created this one okay uh, now before this header i want to float load this left side okay, okay. so this is the header okay in that in the header i want to put another thing header id i want to put a header underscore text okay i will close go to text okay. and i am putting email id email id so i will put my email id in four at solutions box dot co dot in we have seen so many times if we see any 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 website uh, phone numbers they are uh, on the top side and website name is there Okay, so you can also put okay by using this okay so we have mentioned this thing okay we come to design you can see it there okay now for that we need to give some styling okay uh, go to header text 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 okay copy this and paste on the Style sheet. Yes. Okay. Now I want to give some styling. Uh, text align. Right. It. We see it's totally in the right side. Okay. Uh, Font family, font family. I'm going to put lovely. I love this font. Font size will be 20 pixel, 24 pixel. 
कलर 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 वुड बी वाइट ओके फॉन्ट फॉन्ट वेट वेट वुड बी बोर्ड दैट्स इट and i'm going to hit save on save on and if we refresh our page uh, our email id is there okay can give more you can put more things like uh call us or call us the phone number email us email us or send me the email and hit save save on go to website page and refresh email id is there so we have created header with this email id okay okay now we will create our menu okay so copy the menu wrapper okay copy the menu wrapper style sheet okay put has because we are using ids okay inside the curly brace i will put width width would be 900 pixel as we kept earlier okay height it's up to you i uh, i am putting height uh, 40 pixel for my menu bar okay i am going to background color because right now uh, i want to show you okay so i need to put color like uh, red let's chat one so you can see save all and if we refresh our page okay you can see the bar is there menu bar is there okay i mentioned here we will put our menu okay so bar is there okay so that should for the tutorial in the next tutorial we will create uh, menu menu list okay home about and all okay so that should for the tutorial thanks to watching